I went to the talk feeling out of place, a reluctant listener. And Dr. Ravi arrived, didn't know that he was going to be the speaker, a reluctant speaker. But after dinner, the guest speaker gave an unplanned message that resonated with me powerfully, so powerfully that I, after his talk, I raised my hand to ask a question. My question turned into a confession, and then my confession turned into my submission to the cross of Christ. I committed my life to Jesus Christ as my Savior and my Lord. And thereafter, <laughs> thereafter, I joined a small group and started coming to CCF again. My life isn't perfect. And I am not perfect. I still have my struggles until now. But as I grow in my relationship with Jesus, he gives me the grace to resist and overcome sin. My transformation is not yet complete, but I trust that he will finish the work that he started in me. I don't worry about my past anymore, nor am I anxious about my future, because as Paul would put it, it is no longer I who lives, but Christ who lives in me. My name is Hayden Coe Jr., once lost but now found by him who redeems, who confirms, who strengthens, restores, and makes things all new. All glory to God. Praise God. Now, why don't we all pray for him? Because I know our brother here would be used mightily by God. At the same time, Satan would surely want to attack him. So let's pray for him. Father God in heaven, I thank you that in your grace and goodness, you have been looking, searching for Haydn. You have allowed all of those events to happen to him so that he might learn to humble himself. He might learn to surrender.